On the topic of teenagers and grieving, an event was held today to help local kids struggling with the loss of a loved one. WSFA 12 News reporter Simon Schusler was there. Now I feel like really good because now I get to share my feelings with everybody else. Tony King is a fifth grader that lost his grandmother at an early age. He comes every year to Celebration Camp at Riverwalk Stadium to see that he's not alone. So this event, like, it helps you, like, clear your mind. I come in here every year so, so I can share my loved ones with everybody else. Organizers say events like these are crucial because if young ones don't learn how to deal with loss in healthy ways early on, then it can have negative impacts on them for the rest of their life. Children do not grieve like adults do. Mona McDermott directs the camp and sees death every day while working as the bereavement coordinator at Baptist Hospice. She says this event brings a sense of normalcy when kids need it the most. And one thing people say uh, is that they don't feel normal. You know, they feel crazy because of the, the grief feeling and things like that. So we try to show them it's okay. Young ones could take part in multiple arts and craft activities like rock painting. They were also able to listen to songs performed by volunteers with a positive message on faith and love. It's your love. Auburn's mascot, Aubby, made an appearance as well, and there was a memorial service held at the end of the event to recognize the loved ones lost by attendees. Simon Schusler, WSFA 12 News. Simon thinks state troopers were also there to promote seatbelt safety.